audio signals can take on many different forms. One form is acoustic energy, or sound. Sound is created through the movement of an object, like a guitar string, a drum head, a human's vocal cords, or a speaker cone. Sound travels through air by the motion of air molecules that vibrate back and forth many times per second. Audio signals can also take on the form of electrical energy through the change in voltage and current. Audio signals can take on the form of magnetic energy, like when we store magnetically charged domains on analog tape. Audio signals can also be measured data or digital information. In my opinion, I think it's important for audio engineers to have some understanding about the various forms that audio signals can take. I've got a bunch of helpful resources linked below to information, especially if some of these things are new to you. These things will be a very important foundation moving forward.